Hey, today for story time, we're gonna read Six Feet Together, written by Beverly De Silva and illustrated by Kat Uno. Why are we talking about six feet together? Aren't we supposed to say six feet apart? Well, let's figure this out. How far is six feet apart? I think it's bigger than that. How far is six feet apart? Too far to hold hands, too far to give hugs. Too wide to share snacks or ride piggyback. Oh, look at that. Spam musubi and shave ice. Not bad at all. Yummy. The longer we have to stay six feet apart, the farther it seems, the heavier the heart. I think we can all relate watching our parents or watching our brothers and sisters or maybe even us on computers all year long. And all you see are square after square after square of faces. So, but our heart might be heavy, but what is six feet? It's not too far to share a laugh. It's not too far to trade a smile. Here they are surfing. Oh yeah, this takes place in Hawaii, I believe. It's not too wide to make a wish, wave hello, or blow a kiss. Probably better than at this point, right? That works. Six feet is the distance that keeps us safe. It's the distance that shows we care about family and friends, everywhere. And the caring doesn't stop there. Always remember to wash your hands just like your parents taught you. Wash your palms, wash the backs, and between each finger too. Oh, see the little dots on the ground? Those must be six feet apart. Soap and water, take your time, sing happy birthday twice. Pretend there's cake and presents, wouldn't that be nice? Always remember to wear a mask every time you leave the house. Make sure it covers your nose and make sure it covers your mouth. Can you find the people who aren't wearing their masks correctly? Let's take a look. Okay. We know it has to cover your mouth, and we know it has to cover your nose. What about him? Yeah, I think he's okay. What about little Aji over here, Grandma? Yep, she's doing it right. What? I don't think so. Get that thing on your nose and mouth. Mama's doing okay. But what about him who's checking the mail? Uh-uh, it's dropping down just to his chin. She seems to be okay. He's up. Uh, oh, check it out. It's underneath his nose. That's not okay. But his buddy's doing fine. Wearing a mask helps keep others safe in case we aren't well and don't know it. Printed or plain, a mask shows you care about family and friends everywhere. Wearing masks and washing hands, keeping six feet apart. We do these things so we can get back to holding hands and giving hugs and trading tasty snacks. Instead of six feet apart, think of it as six feet together. Six feet together. We are never really that far apart when we have lots of love in our hearts.